four skids today, but check this out. 12 in each, and we got a skid of them. All right, welcome back to the office. First thing, I got my iced tea ready, so. <sighs> Amazingly frustrating day today. Step by step, things are kind of going off, but hopefully everything's gonna turn around. First thing, we got four skids. You probably just saw a quick preview of them. I did not expect them. I was expecting them after today. Today is Canada Day, a holiday, and I'm here working. So when you own a business, it, it is what it is. You're here basically 24 hours. You're on your phone 24 hours. So if you ever want to start a business and think, oh, I'm going to sit back and relax, forget about it. Amy's probably in a pool and I'm sitting down here. It's beautiful outside, not a cloud in the sky. And I'm going to have to bring in a hundred plus boxes inside and uh, organize everything this, that, that. I crank the AC up to max. So at least it'll be a little bit more comfortable, but it's going to be painful. Uh, first thing I want to talk about, fraud, scamming me. Oh my God, I'm losing so much money. Well, you know, it is a lot. So uh, PayPal just contacted me. So we run everything through PayPal because they have confirmations and this and insurance and if anything goes wrong, it's their fault. They'll take care of it. I'm a small guy. They're a multi-billion dollar company. They have the resources to fight anything. So today I was notified that someone has opened four today three yesterday and then the fourth one today so let's take a quick peek at these i have these ready three screens in front of me so i have everything jumbled up first one is they're actually uh two of them are at the same address um uh, kind of googled it i think it's an airbnb but i don't know but they have a credit card anyways i'm not exactly sure how they did this paypal's looking into it they got a fraud department, so, you know, and they, they'll, they'll press charges and stuff like that. So if you're scamming people, I wouldn't suggest it. But um, the first one, two different first names going to the same address. Uh, the first chargeback was for one kit, the Master Grade Full Armor Unicorn version Ka. And the total out the door price was 165 and $165.12. $165.12. So... That was the first one. The second one was Sananju Stein, version Ka again, surprise, surprise. Out the door, taxes, shipping, everything, $138.11. No coupon code needed. <laughs> uh, then we got, this is kind of funny. I, so we got $97.33 for a Super Saiyan Brawly, figure eyes. Um, yeah, that, that, that was the odd one out. And then the last one, the creme de la creme, was a perfect grade, perfect strike Gundam. That was the most frustrating because I remember packaging this one myself. So um, just uh, how much was it? It was out the door, shipped, all that nonsense. Taxes, $484.77. So all in total, I didn't add anything. I didn't add anything beforehand, but it's roughly seven to $800 worth of stuff. Actually, let me... 138 plus 165 plus 97 plus 484. We got $884 worth of chargebacks in a few days. And it's funny because it seems like they were delivered and then the case was open. Reason? Unauthorized transaction. So hopefully that's it. Hopefully there's no more, but that's what I was just dealing with. So I had to get that off my chest. Next, um, Canada Post. Oh my goodness. They're, they're, they're getting back. It's no longer like two weeks, a week, whatever, at just at the depot. At, uh, there, even in uh, my situation, I had something waiting at the depot for one week, and it's only like 10 kilometers away from me. So, and I can pick it up. They had trailers full of stuff. They were out of control. Uh, I'm getting updates from them. Everything's starting to get smoothed out. Everything's starting to get under control. And packages are showing up a lot quicker than they were the past few weeks. So that's, so that's awesome. That's unbelievable. Things are showing up a lot quicker. Great. 
Uh, let's see here. Uh, I think that's it. Uh, we just got to get these skids in. Also going through the boxes. I'm going to see if there's any more damaged... Uh, there was a couple of boxes that were kind of shady looking. So let you know if I find anything else as well. I did want a day off, but not in business. So let's get these skids taken apart and uh, let's get this day started. So let's do this. So we got four skids today. Let me zoom out here. Perfect. So just taking a quick peek at them and check that out. Nice. There's six boxes there. How many do they have in each? Looks like 12. There's probably more in there, probably on the other side. Take a quick peek here. What do we got over here? Some action bases. Oh, paperwork. Let's take a quick peek. So I'm looking at the paperwork here, and this time it says four toys. What? Unless they mean skids. Another nice surprise. I believe we got about 95 somewhere in here. So just got to find them. There's the first box. Just going around the back here. Not much room, but there's another box there. So that's wicked. And it looks like these ones are all blank. So I'm going to have to investigate that. But yeah, let's get these things inside. As for damage, haven't really seen anything. Just a couple of marks like this and that, you know. That might be something. We'll have to take a look. But other than that, skids are in really good shape. So really happy about that. So here are the skids again. And I just took a second look at this. And looking over here. Ugh. So let's, let's get this really open. It's the RG19. 19, 19, 19, 19, 19 is what? Off the top of my head, I can't remember. Oh no. Ugh. That's another part of business. Boneyard stuff. That's all the damage I found so far, so let's get these skids. Let's get these skids opened up. And now we can just start off halfway only. Okay. Swirling doesn't work. That's four. So, number 19 real grade is the ashtray. I actually knew that, I just happened to forget. And, uh... There could be a few boneyard items in here. Oops. Get up there. This one's not too bad. What about this one? Is it just a one kid? Oh, no. There's a second one in here. Which isn't an ashtray. Oops. Let's try and get this one out. So, these ones are going to be in the boneyard at some point. Keep an eye out for them. So I'm just looking at these little guys and I just noticed that one kind of has a butterfly effect for some reason. And that one too, a little. So, I don't know. It's too high for me to get, but hopefully it's nothing. I think we've come to our second victim. No. No. I knew today was not going to be such a great day. Let's see if we can open this up quickly. Put you up here so you can see what's going on. We're good! This could have been a terrible situation, especially with this box. Especially with this little uh, crush in my do, but we lucked out. Box is fine on both sides, let me show you. If there was any kind of damage on these kinds of boxes, they would go straight to the boneyard. But luckily, we avoided that and uh, look what's beside it. So this would have been a terrible box to destroy. Uh, I'm not even sure how, what the value of this box is, but you're probably looking at about, oh, it's up there. So luckily 
Today's turning out okay with this box. Hopefully, you know, we got 70, 80 more to go. So let's hope nothing else is uh, damaged. These are the kits we got damaged so far. We got two of these. And uh, why is this one here? This one seems fine. Okay, so we got three in total. So, yep, that's it so far. So just getting the front of the skids done. And my goodness, is it hot. But at least we'll have a full moon tonight. Ugh, pancake deluxe, anybody? So I'm just getting down to uh, this skid here and I noticed this one actually says how many boxes are on it. 22. Now it doesn't, honestly, it doesn't look like that. I gave it a quick count and it sort of makes sense. So there's a lot on here and uh, I actually preferred not to see that because that's 22 trips if I carry one box each. So it's, it's getting hot and uh, might need to take a break soon, get another iced tea. So the skids are tackled and Notable mentions. So we have one, two, three, oops, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten over there, and eleven, Mr. Butterfly here. So eleven times twelve, that's one hundred thirty-two. So we got a hundred and two yeah. So we got hundred and thirty-two of these. But let's get to this butterfly one and see what is going on. Okay. Everything seems to be in order. I guess it's just the box. But uh, yeah. And then we also have the Beyond Global. Now, I swear I thought we had four boxes. Let me zoom out here four boxes but right now we got three and each one has 24 pieces so let's take a look at this thing all right there we go all right so right now we have four times i mean two i think we got 96 but here's 72 of them i must have brought it inside so and then let's see if we have anything else to show you. So we ended up getting, I think, 16 or 18 of these. We either got 16 or 18 of these, so let's uh, pop this open. This is one I haven't seen in about two years. I don't think we stocked it for about two years. That's what I'm trying to say. Six in a box. Ugh. All right, let's get you seated here. Let's see if we can pull out one over here. Nice. Because oh, of all that work, now my shirt is all wrinkly and neck's hanging down. But next, to uh, make the day even better, I got a credit card bill from American Express. So I love getting things like this uh, on days like today. All right, let me black some things out with my crazy Sharpie marker here. Nope. Oh my God, the amount of numbers on here. I think that's it. All right, so. So I'll bring you down here and we got $113,850.33. And we got about 11 days to pay it. No, 10 days now. And that's the amount due. There's no minimum payment. That's the payment we have to provide them or they take away the credit card. So that's awesome. This day can't get any better. So that's pretty much it for today. I still got a bunch of work to do, but I'm I'm not gonna be shipping anything today. It is a holiday anyways, so Canada Post is not coming. Uh, I still got a ton of boxes to put away. Um, just found out on top of everything, Amy's not gonna be around tomorrow to help. So my plan right now, I'm gonna spend the next two hours just putting things away as much as I can, cleaning up this disaster of a desk. We got all kinds of things here from all new items that we added. I had to see what this was on paper. You don't know what it is, but you, you kind of want to see the product just to make sure that you got the right thing. You're adding the right thing. 
uh, to the website. So I got all that to do. My plan for tomorrow, since it's going to be me, myself, and I, is I'm going to probably show up probably 4 in the morning and just hustle till about 2, 3 o'clock when Canada Post shows up and try and get as much out as possible. So, guys, I'll see you tomorrow morning. Canada Post has just arrived. Uh -oh.